xdc 7 here, and welcome back to the channel. We are playing Transocean Shipping Company, and as you may notice up here, some things have changed. Um, <laughs> yeah, I kind of uh, had a couple of kind of major surges forward here when I was trying to, uh, when last we left off, I was in the midst of completing a contract that would allow us to buy Panamax. Well, I finished that and it opened up some other things and I did a couple of more little contracts not expecting much and I knocked my rating up to where it opened up the uh, the entire map. So now as you can see like we've got Hong Kong and Singapore listed in this port. Um, I won't be taking them right now but and the other thing that has changed quite a bit. Well thank you. If we go here and look, you'll see I now have three ships. Ah, stop. <laughs> I always forget, and, and that's a really kind of a weird thing. Whenever you go to your map, it always starts time again. So you got to be really careful. Like, that probably cost I've got, well, luckily only one ship in port. The other two, yeah, indeed, are at sea. We have bought a Panamax, which I call the Terra Nova. And uh, that's the name of the ship I was on when I was in the Navy. But anyway, so we do have a Panamax level, and she is just almost... Oh, uh, actually no, she's about halfway. She's going to New York. The Cranberry is actually on her way to Halifax, a place where I spent quite a bit of time. So, with that said, and actually, I need to uh, go back to the Voyager here get her underway so yeah with that said look at things have opened up massively here and uh, I need to get to Stockholm right I do believe that Stockholm yes it is and uh, arrives in 14 days 18 day contract good enough let's get there so yeah other than that um, that's why we're only down at 2.7 million. I waited until the lovely Miss Smith took her money, and then uh, I bought us a Panamax. I opened a subsidiary here in St. Petersburg for 1.5 million dollars. That allowed me to actually buy a Panamax. Here we go. Whoa! Uh, Halifax is unlocked. Fuel is cheap. Good reputation, receive offers to ship antiques, luxury goods, and less money, less money, less money, pirates are going to hate our guts, etc, <laughs> etc. That's what I mean, things started to unlock at sort of that rate, so that's why we didn't kind of, yeah, <laughs> catch all of it on camera, and for that I apologize. But anyway, we just went all the way from Dublin, Ireland to Halifax, Canada place where I did my basic training for the Navy, amongst other things. Met a lot of great people there. The east coast of this country is cold and wet, but by God, the people are nice. So, we need to, since they told us fuel was it cheap, we're going to fill it right up. The other thing I've been doing is running the ship improvements. Um, I've been expanding the licenses as high as they would go. Right, you start with one then expand two, then expand to three. It allows you to carry other cargoes. All right. Um, ooh, I haven't done this yet. So that's something I really should do. I believe the other ships I have pretty much done it. It's not cheap. I mean, it's 200,000, 300, so half a million. It costs you a million bucks to do all three. And I think it takes a total of six days. So the... Uh, very next time that I get a chance here, I will certainly do that. If we go back to ship status, ooh, 89%. Okay, there's something I do have to deal with. Because uh, that won't, will not do at all. That uh, ocean crossing did a lot to this guy. Most of my reputation buildup has been because I've been keeping my ships in as good a condition as possible. So, okay, we need to pause here because the Voyager is about to dock. Alright, 
she's at 93 percent so that's not bad and it's sitting in Stockholm now uh, fuel in Stockholm well it's not cheap but we are going to take advantage of it what have we got for contracts New York Havana oops we are not refrigeration system needed yeah see some vessels now this is our Voyager, and I've already upgraded everything available. So if I can't, if it still comes up with this arrow, um, you can take these, but it's like contraband goods, man. They will ding you but good. If you are caught moving that stuff, yeah. You can, uh, I suppose... Ooh. I wonder how long that will actually take me. Oh, by the way, if anybody's wondering the different sets of numbers, 31 days, that's how many more days this contract will be available. I was watching a YouTuber yesterday doing a run of this, and he seemed to think that this was the actual, like, a deadline. No, if there's a number on top, that's your deadline. This is just how many more days this particular contract will be available. So if you want to fix your ship, but you don't want to lose a $2 million contract, you can go, oh, no problem, six days to fix the ship. That's still going to leave me almost a month to pick this contract up, right? So, yeah. And I think what we're going to do is accept this and accept this. All right. That should make us a little bit of money. Cool. And cast off. Now the New York contract is actually timed. 31 days, but we have lots of time to get there. So, let's, uh... Yeah. We're off. Off to New York. Now... Uh, on your way. Uh, oops, yeah, okay. Just wait there for a sec. I gotta check on this guy. Things do start to uh, get up there a little bit. Now the cranberry is now back at her full, full Sparky, and she's sitting in Halifax Harbor. Uh, those I can't take. Eight million. Wow. An eight million dollar contract. To Colombo. Hmm. And I have just enough fuel to do it. It's 80 days. Hmm. 56 days is what they figure it'll take me. You know what? I'm gonna take this. Yes, indeed. An eight million dollar contract. Wowzer, guys. That's just crazy. And, uh, all the way to Colombo. Alright, well, the cranberries uh, got a long journey. 52 days, and we've got 80 to make it. And the Terra Nova is ready to dock in New York City. Now, they wanted us to send a Panamax class. That was this one. One contract to America using a Panamax. There we go, we did it. Fuel is affordable. Hmm, apparently not. Uh, to the port. Oh, here we go. Got a foothold. Hardly any firms are interested. We need to change that. Okay. Establish a subsidiary in America. All right. Well, hmm. We can do that. I don't know how much uh, particular good it's going to do us, but we can certainly do that. In New York, costs forty million dollars. Alrighty then. Let's, um, not, wow. So what do we got here? I need this guy's licenses to come up. So, a million bucks for a level one. Wow. A level two for two million. Whew, okay. I think we'll, uh, call that good for the moment. <laughs> And a contracts list. Let's fill this puppy up. Oh, I like this. Look at these contracts we're getting now. Oh no, it looks like pretty much all of them though. Ooh. Wow. Look at that. 
105 days. Oh, um, ship status. We need to fill you up. There we go. Contracts list. So, 18 million, but it's all the way to China. Ooh, we have enough fuel. 56 days, 105. You know what? We're going to take this. So we are. Uh, that is about the only contract we're licensed to accept. 105 days, accept. Now, 56 days is how long? 36 days if we pump a little extra fuel. But, am I actually going to have enough fuel then? No. <laughs> that's as close as we can get, so let's do that, guys. Wow, that's a lot of money, man. Um, yeah, all the way to Shanghai. That's trippy. 51 days. <laughs> okay, I'm still not getting a cast off. How come? What's going on here? I have enough fuel. The tonnage is good. Yeah. Oh, she's not ready to leave yet. That's why. Okay. Um. Ready in two days. My reputation is sunk. Hmm, that's odd. Okay, well, whatever. I have no idea why. So we can cast off now, though, can't we? Now that I've spent a couple of days sitting here. Alright. Everybody is in an en route situation at the moment. So. Ooh. However, your investor is granting you a line balance your account as fast as possible. Ooh, okay. I guess we've kind of... Uh, Excuse me, San Antonio to Vancouver. We've got 12 months. Hmm. <coughs> <coughs> oh, I'm sorry, guys. Excuse me. Come on, we need money. And the Voyager is docking in New York. We made 1.5 million off of that. Yikes. Not quite as much as one might like. So... We do still have a contract to Canada. Um, hmm. Anchorage oof, for two million. That'd be kind of a neat trip, but um, Fremantle, Australia. We can go to Hong Kong. Anchorage, Alaska, eh? 2 million? 68 days? Yeah, sure. Let's take that. Okay. Well, let's cast off. We need to go to Halifax. Take us 3 days. Let's get there. And we're in Halifax. <laughs> okay, 754,000. Fuel is affordable. We'll top up the little bit that we can. 91%, eh? Alright, is there anybody else going to... I'm not going to haul mail back to New York. It's just not worth it. Oh, here's another run to Anchorage. Perfect. I love it. That's really going to help. Except, three and a half million dollar contract. Cast off for 
Anchorage. 68 days. We've got, ooh. Hmm. That's gonna be kind of hard on fuel, though, isn't it? Well, yeah. 45 days, a 64-day contract. Sounds good to me. Let's get there. New ships. Interest rate on your credit is due. Oh, come on. We need to make some money. Somebody make port. Um, why do I only see? Oh no, they're all traveling. Ah, lovely. Okay, the Terra Nova is just about to pull into Shanghai as well. We just made 7.9 million. We are back in. Ooh, fuel's expensive here, but we're just about empty. So, we are now in Colombo. Cool. Now, where can we go? What's good monies here? Antiques to Australia. Well, oh, it's not Australia. Hmm. Got textiles to Quebec. Hmm. Oh, I see. That's where we are. Okay. Alright, I think we'll take this guy. Accept that. Accept. Okay. And... Cast off. Where the heck are we going here? All the way to there, eh? Wow. 52 days. Alright, have fun with that. And... The Terra Nova is ready to pull in. We just made 15 million. <laughs> New York to Shanghai, 15 million dollars, man. Yeah, 1.5 million for fuel. Well, if that's what it takes, let me tell you. And we are going to. One, zero. There we go. She's back in full ho -ho flight. Yeah, thank you. So, what are we going to go with here now? Four million to Auckland. Another four million to there. Ooh, 13 million to Lisbon, eh? Antiques. 719 ton. that. Yeah, we could certainly take these. They're awful close together. Uh, nope. Close to New York. Yeah, not really. Let's take what we've got. And... Oh, uh, what's closest? This one, I guess. 35 days, and then we've got, oh yeah, lots of time to get to the next one. Let's go. Good that we uh, jumped out of our horrible hole there. Interest rates. So we're back up to world famous, at least. And we're about to pull into Alaska. There we go. Docking in Alaska. And that just made us another five million. Wow, we're, this is nice. We actually get to, uh, and fuel here is good. Not bad. Not bad at all. 87%. Yeah, I think it's time that we did this guy up. It's going to take us a few days, but that's all right. It'll give us time for one of our other vessels to get in. Two, maybe. <laughs> Distances are a lot more now takes a while before your vessels actually come on. So there we go. That's better. 
How about ship improvements? She's already tuned up as tuned up as she'll get, so... All we need to do now is find us some good fat contracts. Uh-oh. Hmm. See, here's a problem. We're not actually licensed for some of this stuff. Damn. So basically, you see, there's no contracts here that we can accept. So we're in Anchorage. Damn. Um, I can't go to any port I haven't unlocked. So New York. That's terrible. That is absolutely terrible. So what we're actually going to do is, uh, sad as this sounds, we're going to have to let her sit there for a day or two. There we go. Some new contracts available. Go away. There. Now we have some legal contracts. Much better. So we've got one here to Singapore. And then just down from there. So that would give us a quick three mil. Alright, we'll take those two. That'll get us back on that side of the world. Got enough fuel easily. Accept, accept, and we'll go to, I guess it's this one first. Alright, this one actually has the uh, limitation on it, so we'll go there first, shall we? And look at her wiggling up through the canal. Very neat. So I think that this shot ship docking will be good for this episode. Ooh, we need another 2.9 million. So, fuel her up, and that was not our complete trip either. Because we still need to go to Lisbon. What else have we got? So we're going there. Okay. Um. Hmm. I suppose. Well, how about if we just head to where we need to be going, which is right here, and drop that off and see what sort of contracts we get. But yeah, as I say, guys, I think I'm going to uh, leave her here for this episode. And uh, I'll make us a few more millions, and I guess our next goal is to... Uh, oh. So they, they upgraded this, and they see now they got 6 of 30 contracts delivered to or from America. Ha, huh, what do you know? And there's a quick 13 million on top of what we had. <laughs> so, alright guys, I think I'm going to call her here, like I said. If you liked the episode, please leave a like, leave a comment. Always nice to talk to you guys. So, till next time, take care of each other, folks. This has been Species 7, and, well, ciao for now. Pretty ship, eh? <laughs>